hello everyone and welcome to our next video uh, today in this video we will going to learn a very important concept in tableau that is live connection versus extract connection so what does it mean live connection versus extract connection what is what is the purpose of it what are its advantages and disadvantages what are their applications so let's learn about this in this video so let's first start with the live connection so live connection as you as you can uh, understand from the name itself that live connection means that data would be directly connected to your tableau and it will give you or uh, or a flexibility or allow you to work like a real time data so it means since the data connection is real time so any changes you make in the data it will immediately reflect on your tableau dashboard as well so for example so for example if you have added a, a new department let's say in your data then this new department will immediately reflect in your tableau analysis as well or tableau graphs as well now this can be useful for various situation where we need to work that is constantly changing such as real time financial data stock data weather data or a social media metrics data now let's understand about the extract connection so as you can understand from the word extract itself it's like we are extracting a data from certain date or like a static snapshot of data that will get stored in the uh, tableau memory now now this connection will not be a live connection so let's say you have pulled all the data till yesterday so since you have pulled the data till yesterday so all your analysis on the tableau dashboard will show you the graphs only till yesterday so any data which you have pulled today will not be will not be shown in the tableau dashboard so that is the extract connection but obviously you can refresh your extract and you can see the latest changes as well but that's the difference between live and extract live whether you update the data today tomorrow or uh, it will immediately reflect on your tableau uh, dashboard whereas if if you have extract connection uh, if you have extracted the data till yesterday then it will going to show you the numbers only till the uh, last extracted data which is yesterday so that's why it will not be give you a feel like a real time but the advantage of the extract is that especially when you working with a very huge large data sets it can be very useful uh, to use extract connection because they can optimize your performance and so on so let's go into the tableau and let's understand what is the uh, how can we do live versus extract what is the difference what are the things uh, we can feel on the tableau dashboard so let's go into the tableau so right now i am uh, we are in a tableau dashboard so let's connect our data so before we connect our data let me give you a quick walk through uh, on the data so let me delete this last three rows so let's assume that we have a data set which has only two columns a uh, name and the salary and we have three rows john mike nancy and their salaries so let's save it and then let's connect this data into our tableau dashboard uh, connect to data then excel live extract file and this data has been connected so you see on the top we have a live so i am taking as a live and we can see that it's showing that there are three uh, two columns name and salary and these are the three values now let's go back into sheet 1 let's track name and their salary salary and then name so we can see the name and the salary are showing here the name and the salary are showing in let me pull it back so the name and salary are showing here now let's see uh, about the live connection uh, features so let's go back to my excel sheet and let me add the fourth row let's say fourth row would be tableau let's say there is a guy named tableau and its salary let's i'm putting uh 300000 so 300000 i'm putting its salary and let's save this file and i'm I, i will go back into tableau and let's refresh this connection and you can see immediately i can see the 300000 salary of what tableau so this is this is how the live connection will work immediately the moment you make any changes in your backend in your data the analysis will immediately reflect on your tableau dashboard now let's go with the other way example of extract connection now it's a time to see how the extract connection works so let me go back to data source and connect to extract so when i create the when i select the extract it's saying that they have extracted all the data till 226 26 feb at uh, 3:49 pm so it means uh, any data I, i i refresh afterwards or i add or update any data on my backend it will it, it will not going to reflect so let's say right now is 350 let me update a row in my live extract csv file 
so let me i'm adding abc and now i'm adding salary this much and i'm saving it now let me go back to it and now it's saying that you know extract includes all, all data till 349 so this row has been added at 351 so i'm expecting after my uh, let's refresh like live and you see the now the the that uh, that new row is not coming because the extract or the data which we pulled which is which i pulled at 349 and whatever changes i made after 349 it will not going to reflect here so in order to see that we need to extract the latest data so in order to extract the latest data we need to go here click on this extract now refresh it so it's asking do we need to extract the entire content and get replies blah 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 and you need to put it as yes when we put it as yes now abc name has been pop up with their salary so you can see with the extract it's not a real time so you always have to you know pull your data whenever you want to see your latest changes whereas in the case of a live connection it will be completely live so both the connection live and extract has their own advantages has their own application as i said you know if your application really really demands on real time then obviously go with the live connection but if your application can sustain without a live connection and has a very huge amount of data very large data sets maybe then you can use uh, extract connection so that's pretty much uh, between live and extract connection so i hope um, you got the basic idea about the live and extract and the more you practice on the live and extract the more idea you will start getting you know where i should use the live connection where i should extract connection and so on so thank you very much for this video